Dear students, we were discussing the page layout ribbon and today we will be focusing on paragraph group in page layout ribbon. So in the previous module we have tried to implement things, experiment things on the whole document. So today we will try to focus on only different paragraphs to make different options visible. So the main two things which we will be discussing today are indent and spacing. So let's start the practical. So we are on the page layout ribbon and these options were discussed in the previous module which were mainly working on the whole document. So today we are mainly focusing on the paragraph group. So in the paragraph group we have two main things. One is called indent and the other is called spacing. So in the indent what does it mean? So let's try to apply it. So for example we are on this paragraph. We go over here and we press indent. So you can see that this paragraph is intending from the normal flow from left side. Similarly we can also do it from the right side. So you might have seen such a content available in different documents to highlight the things. So from where we do not have the page margin which we applied in the last module for the whole document but we want to set the margin for a typical paragraph. So for setting a margin of a typical paragraph we can use this indent option. So let's go to the normal flow. And then there is another option known as spacing. So spacing again have two things. One is spacing before and the other option is spacing after. So spacing before means that if you are standing on this paragraph and you select spacing before this, so it will add such kind of spacing before this paragraph which you are focusing or on which you have clicked or where your cursor is present. So you are giving more spacing before this paragraph. So if you say that I need spacing after this paragraph, so you are on the same paragraph and you are saying that I need spacing downward. So any content which is present after this paragraph will have such effect which will be done when you are standing on this paragraph. So using these two options you can play with the individual paragraph by selecting the indentation from left and right and then the spacing before and afterwards to make this text more focused and more readable and more prominent. So dear students we have today discussed two important things related to paragraph and those were indent and spacing. So these were the experiments on paragraph group in page layout ribbon.